So I'm here because I've grown up in Boston my whole life. I've seen it go become more and more expensive to live here. And I've seen young people, parishioners, have to move from the city because they can't afford the prices to be here. And what it seems to me is that if people work, they go and they do what we've asked them to do to have a job and to work, we should give them what it takes to put food on their table. Um, people shouldn't have to work 40 hours and live in a homeless shelter. Any system that allows people to work and doesn't give them what they need to live is an unjust system. What we're here to do is to remind the citizens of Massachusetts, and particularly the legislators of Massachusetts, um, that we cannot celebrate Dr. King's dream in January if we don't allow every single worker to be part of that dream, everybody to be able to go and have a put in a hard day's work and come home and put food on their table. That we need a livable wage for people can support their family. There's 50 percent of more than 50 percent of black workers make under 15 dollars. Nearly 60 percent of black Latino workers make less than $15. So to me, the math is wrong. We, should, we deserve to be able to take care of our family, provide for our family, be able to pay for housing, being able to pay for a way to get to work. There's a lot of things that are taken are taken for granted that a lot of people think that we don't need or we don't um, we don't work hard for, but we work hard for our families, we work hard for our friends, we work hard for everything we need in life. We're trying to sustain our family at the end of the day. We're trying to survive.